When I first started the Moving Forward program at the VA, I described myself in ways that were just like the thoughtful planner. I wasn't impulsive or avoidant while in the service and felt confident when dealing with sticky situations. I just did what I needed to do to accomplish my missions. However, looking back over how I handled many of the problems I initially encountered after coming back home, I realize now that sometimes I was thoughtful and planful when dealing with certain problems, but most of the time I was either the avoider or the quick fixer. When I first started working at the warehousing company, everyone liked my style. I got a lot of praise and was told that I could go far in the company. My ease with logistics in the service seemed to help me quite a bit, plus I had a great work ethic. But the sicker my dad got, the more I became stressed and just didn't want to believe that he was that sick. I guess I just denied the seriousness of his cancer. I avoided thinking about it. But of course, I really couldn't. I tried to make things right by fixing my dad's health, which was really not fixable. I felt if I just made it clear to the doctors that he needs to live, it would be okay. I also initially tried to fix everything at work so I could feel in control of things. But the more stressed I got, the more preoccupied and less effective I was. When my dad died, despite both my avoiding and quick fixing, I became paralyzed and numb. That's when I began to avoid everything and everybody by shutting down. I'm lucky I didn't go the drinking route, but it was similar. I just felt numb all the time. Of course, that didn't make things better. In fact, it made things worse. Because of the Moving Forward program, now I know that when I do feel stress, I think of that as a big red light, telling me that something is going on that needs my thoughtful, problem-solving style to come front and center to deal with the situation and prevent Brandon the avoider or Brandon the quick fixer from taking over. I came to realize that sometimes it was easier to be planful, like at work, but when dealing with relationships with women or feeling the pain of losing someone, I either avoided or tried to fix everything so I didn't have to feel any pain. I've never been a very touchy-feely kind of person, but becoming more aware of how I really felt led me to deal with the situation better. I was worried about losing more people, so the best way to deal with that was to simply not get close to anyone. I lost my dad, my mom, my marine buddies, and my wife. I couldn't lose anyone else. But realizing that allowed me to deal rationally with this fear and not let it take over my life. It's hard, sometimes very hard, but it's worth it.